Matt, right decision in the end, wasn't it? It was getting worse and worse, and it was. Uh, it, uh, there's not many times you're on a football pitch thinking about how cold you are, how what the conditions are like, um, and I'm looking at that clock and it weren't moving. Um, so, as I say, there's not many times I've been on the football pitch and noticed my surroundings as much as today. It was it was horrible, and uh, I think the sooner rather than later. It could have been a bit earlier, I think. The lads are still shivering. It was it was horrible. It was horrible. Was it, were you talking to the referee during the game, or were the players? Yeah, everyone to... was on him. Everyone was the same. I mean, in the back of your mind, you're thinking, I, I don't want the game to finish because you want to you want to do it. You want to yeah. finish it tonight, and you want to get in front. But at the same time, I think Nicky Adams nearly got topped on the halfway line then, and there's a uh, potential for a few bad injuries out there. So that's the last thing that we need. And uh, and the conditions got worse and worse. Um, I don't think I've played in yeah, 12 you, years, I don't think I've played in worse conditions than that, I really don't, and that's not just saying it on the spur of the moment, I, I actually don't think I have. It was it was horrific, it was really bad. And it wasn't just the rain, of course, it was the wind. Yeah. Uh, in a, we had the advantage of it in the first half, of course, uh, maybe should have scored a goal, but mm -hmm. I think the longer it went on and you're thinking if there's a mistake that sells this, then you know the referee might be obliged to actually finish it, and that wouldn't be fair on Yeah, side, I mean, in the first half it was an advantage to a degree, but I think in the first half some of our balls in behind were just flying out of play and then I think the first two balls that they tried to play in behind ended up landing in a couple of puddles after we'd left them thinking they'd go out of play and uh, stayed in play so I think I just don't know uh, what you can do out there when it's like that it's 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 really bad it's horrible to play football in and it and uh, I think it probably showed because the, the standard of football was terrible because we weren't allowed to play on that. It was it was it was not a contest of two football teams, so it probably needed to be called off maybe 10, 15 minutes earlier. But physically, it would have taken a bit <coughs> out of the boys because it's hard work running through all that water, isn't it? Yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, I always think you can do 60 minutes pretty comfortably, and then uh, the, the 30 minutes after that, are what the, are what um, get the old lactic in the uh, legs. So. I, I think we've just gone over the, that threshold, so I think it shouldn't be too bad. We'll do the uh, recovery and everything as, as normal, but I think the main thing is just making sure that everyone gets home, gets warm, and uh, and he's um, physically okay in the way of no uh, you know no illness or anything like that, colds or flus from the from how bad that was. So get home, rest up, and uh, get warm. Go again on Saturday. Go again on Saturday.